All right, welcome everybody. My name is Beard Unknown. We've got some patch notes today for Dead by Daylight. We're gonna read them off real quick and uh, see what's what's new. This just released to today. We've got let's see, important. This is uh, patch notes from uh, patch notes 8.2.2. Uh, it's a bug patch fix. Important from September 12th, the pricing of eight original characters will be reduced. Ace Ben Scotty, Fen Ming, Kate, add ons. Uh, Liquor Tongue. Survivors are hindered for one extra second after being contaminated, was three seconds. Uh, no, Nemesis hindered effect was much lower than intended. Uh, this was uh, fixes up uh, uh, as of this update, promoting the Liquor Tongue add on to be balanced accordingly the dark lord bat form movement speed changed to 6.5 meters a second was six teleport speed changed to 12 meters a second it was 10 uh shape shift cooldown changed to 2.5 it was five uh add on magical ticket reduced to 10 percent compensation for increased teleport speed was 25 percent all right and then we've got so there, he's getting a pretty good buff he's getting a, a pretty decent buff bug fixes audio missing audio uh fixed missing oh my god fixed missing idle audio on the dredge fixed missing halloween theme on michael myers fixed an issue that caused the dark lord's flame pillar charging sound to not be heard from the survivor's pers perspective okay so those are all good wins characters fix an issue that caused trickster to uh, lack some financial animation when in the lobby Fixed an issue that caused Dark Lord's Traveler's hat add-on not to function. Fixed an issue that caused Nemesis Tentacle Strike to apply the incorrect hindered value to survivors. Fixed an issue where the Dark Lord could attack while transforming. I saw people spamming that. That was actually a problem. People, yeah, people were abusing that one big time. Fixed a collision issue with the Dark Lord's pounce attack. Uh, environment and maps fixed an issue in the family residence where the dredge would get stuck in a locker uh, <laughs> that's funny but the good they fixed it okay uh, man that would be terrible uh, fix an issue with area of crows where the killer can't grab from a side of a generator fixed an issue in toba landing where the nurse could blink on top of a stone pillar uh, fixed an issue in Raccoon City police station where a character could land on top of a light fixture when vaulting. Okay, fixed an issue in no, uh, Nostromo wreckage that followed that allowed the nurse to blink underneath the main building through the t uh, the floor of two ledges. Fix an issue in Toba Landing where fog covered the ceiling and stairs in the basement obstructing visibility uh continuing the global cleanup of collision on all maps fixed a window on the decimated borgo that could not probably be interacted with okay that one was big uh fix an issue that would cause fire up perk not to gain tokens when a bot completed a generator okay i mean all good things um i'm curious to see how the dark lord is gonna play because he seemed he seemed pretty strong already, um, but yeah, those are the that's the updates from today's patch. So if you want more content like this, make sure to hit that subscribe button, hit the little bell notification, and uh, yeah, tell me in the comments what you think of the changes and uh, the the buffs, especially the buffs to to the Dark Lord here to Drac, and uh, we'll see you in the next one.